All new for you this evening. We know an estimated 476,000 Americans are diagnosed and treated for Lyme disease each year. The CDC says it's becoming common in more areas of the U.S. Now, the only vaccine in development to prevent it is headed to phase three trials. Tonight, we are explaining what happens next if it's found to be safe and effective and the timeline for when it could become available. It's the only vaccine in development that could protect against Lyme disease. Pfizer says it will begin a large clinical trial together with a French vaccine company testing whether its vaccine is safe and effective. Well, the best part about Lyme disease is it's preventable. Health experts say wearing repellent with at least 20% deep concentration along with long sleeves and pants can also stop ticks from being able to latch on and transmit the bacteria that causes the disease. But right now there's no vaccine to prevent it. Around 6,000 people ages 5 and older will be recruited for the trial. Those who take part will be given three doses of the vaccine or placebo, followed by a booster dose. The vaccine targets the bacteria that causes the disease, and the company says it's shown a safe and strong immune response in previous trials. Lyme disease is spread through a tick bite. Initially, it's a little red spot where the bite took place. But then the redness expands. Antibiotics can knock out the infection early on, but if left untreated, the infection can spread to the joints, heart, and nervous system. If there's been a tick and we are uncertain of the length of time this tick has been on our body, in other words, it could be longer than one to two days, uh, we should seek medical attention. If the vaccine is found to be safe and effective, Pfizer says it could submit requests for approval in the U.S. and Europe in 2025.